Was Neuralink's chip implant in animals' brains successful? As he promised to implant chips in human brains, how far will it go? In this video, we'll show you what you should know about Neuralink, Elon Musk's technology that promised to implant chips in the human brain, where the project was first experimented with by testing animal brains. Before we start, please like and subscribe to this channel, and then sit back and relax. Dead Animals and Organizations for the Protection of Living Beings, an explosive cocktail that Neuralink and Elon Musk will have to face. Why? Continue watching. The Neuralink Project, led by entrepreneur Elon Musk, focuses on creating a brain-machine interface that would allow people to improve their cognitive ability by implanting electrodes in the brain. This technology raises many ethical issues that need to be considered. Among all these ethical issues is animal welfare. That is, Neuralink has been investigating the use of live animals since 2018. The animals chosen for their research include sheep, pigs, and monkeys. Although the company has always commented on the security of its project, the reality is very different. Since 2018, nearly 1,500 of these animals have died, a figure important enough to take into account. Today, some information has come to light that reveals unconventional practices in Neuralink, and that, unfortunately, had been the cause of the loss of these animals. Elon Musk's company would have committed certain imprudence when developing different tests. Among these errors is not using the correct surgical glue or implanting a brain chip of a size that does not correspond to the animal, the result in both cases being the sacrifice of the animal in question. Animal Abuse Neuralink in Front of the Ropes the fact is that Elon Musk does not appear to have won, although based on the reports provided, he would have been the one to issue distinct instructions when working with these creatures. All of this has gotten Neuralink entangled in a federal probe. The fact that there are chips implanted in the brains of animals has caused concern, so we need to go into more detail so that you can understand. The Neuralink tests on monkeys and pigs Elon Musk was investigated for animal abuse for Neuralink tests on monkeys and pigs. The United States Department of Agriculture has launched an investigation into cases of animal deaths reported by employees. We already know that many of Elon Musk's promises regarding the future have to be taken with a grain of salt, or, at least, with skepticism. On the other hand, some of his works glimpse an exciting future in which sight can even be restored to people with visual disabilities. Along with the promise to implant its famous brain chips in humans, for the first time comes a legal threat where the United States will investigate Neuralink for animal abuse. According to Reuters, based on internal documentation, the United States Department of Agriculture has opened an investigation into the treatment of animals in its technological tests. The investigations will seek to clarify whether Neuralink has perpetrated cases of animal abuse, causing the alleged death of 1,000, 500 animals since 2018. All this stems from the complaint of various employees of the company, more specifically, more than 20 current and former employees of the firm, ensure that there are serious concerns about the welfare of the animals used for Neuralink's technological experiments. U.S. to investigated Neuralink. The full extent of the investigation is currently not exactly known. Reports from Reuters sources speak of experiments with dire consequences for animals. In some cases, certain animals would have been caused severe suffering, sometimes resulting in their direct deaths. One of the cases shows how an experiment caused 25 pigs out of a group of 60 to be fitted with, supposedly, a device of the wrong size as part of a study. On another occasion, two pigs would have had devices installed in the wrong vertebra. Reuters exposes how at least one of these animals had to be euthanized due to the suffering supposedly caused by the experiment. This investigation, promoted by the Inspector General of the United States Department of Agriculture, has been open for months. According to documents and internal sources available to Reuters, the number of animals killed would have risen to 1,500, including monkeys, sheep, and pigs. Let us remember that, indeed, the demonstrations of the technological potential of Neuralink had been carried out exclusively with animals. In the year 2021, we were able to see a monkey named Pager play Palm with his mind thanks to a brain implant in a demonstration that, according to Neuralink, was the result of years of research. We had previously seen the implant in a pig. 
Regarding the use of animals for scientific experiments, the legislation does not explicitly prohibit their use for tests of various kinds, such as experiments with medicines. On the other hand, U.S. institutions give companies a certain margin so that they have greater control over how they use these animals to carry out their studies and tests. Be that as it may, it must be clarified that these employees have assured that the main cause of deaths is due to the requirements to repeat tests. In addition, since this information is based on internal documentation and testimonials from these workers, the figures could be different. On the other hand, Neuralink has recently talked about the treatment of animals in a promotional video. Although to date there was no legal complaint regarding Neuralink's treatment of animals, since the beginning of its operations it has not been without criticism. At the beginning of 2022, the organization PCRM, Physicians Committee for Responsible Medicine, positioned against the use of animals in scientific experiments, warned about this problem based on a study prepared by scientists from the University of California. This study claimed that they treated their monkeys in degrading ways in some experiments, something that Neuralink denied, stating that both the facilities and those responsible for the company complied and continue to comply with the standards required by the federal government. Added to this is the fact that Musk reportedly created a climate of experimentation that, according to Reuters, suffers from a lack of preparation and stress from employees struggling to meet deadlines. So much so, that Musk would have gone so far as to tell his employees that for them to work faster, they imagine that they have a bomb strapped to their heads. At the moment, there is no firm evidence of these irregularities until the federal investigation bears its first fruits. Although Elon Musk stated that he intended for Neuralink tests to start in humans in 2023, all evidence points to the fact that this technology is not yet ready for use. However, we will have to wait to watch how things play out, and more importantly, how Neuralink handles this study. The success rate reported in the Neuralink testing is insufficient, especially given that it asserts to be a technology used with humans. The company's efforts are hampered by the moral conundrum that results from implanting this brain chip in live things, the majority of which die. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit like, the subscription button, and the notification bell. To get notified when new videos are uploaded from this channel, please share your thoughts about Elon Musk and Animal's Brain Test, everything you need to know about Neuralink in the comment section below. Thank you.